friends, it's me. Today we're gonna check out some proof of why your life is a lie. When the employees are hungry at work, so they got this deviously genius pizza hack. They got two pieces of pizza out of this pizza, and then they're gonna cut it, put it back together, like it never even happened. How could those two slices be missed if you didn't even know they existed in the first place? I don't see y'all like whipping out a measuring tape like this, missing a few inches. I had no idea that they were looking at the screen while doing the weather. Excuse me? I thought the weathermen had like a screen behind them and they would like point to things. Or even like a green screen behind them and they start pointing to the screen. But I'm like, wait, how could they possibly know where things are? So he's looking at a screen of himself and then starts pointing to things. I did not know that. What? You mean the weathermen don't actually control the weather? I hate to break it to you. You know on Bikini Bottom, the houses, I could not tell you who lives here. So the houses are actually made of car mufflers that fell into the ocean due to pollution. This thing. Next thing you know, the fishes is moving in and they live there now. Stop polluting! Ladies, how old are you when you realize that you can peel the old layers off a nail file and there's a new layer underneath? What? You can peel your nail file? I ain't got one on me at the moment, but I will be testing this immediately. Like they got layers and layers and layers of new nail files like just stuck onto one. Someone told me the Toblerone logo has a bear on it and I looked everywhere. I'm like, wait, where? Where is the bear? And then look at the mountain. Look at it. Do you see the outline of the bear? He's standing like this. What does a Toblerone have to do with a bear? Now every time you see a Toblerone, bear, toe, bear, loan. I just found out 87 is divisible by 29. What the heck? No way. I need to see this. I gotta see the math. 87 divided by 29, 3, 8. It, why does that feel illegal? It's like an ugly couple having a very good looking child type of pan storage. Your plugs. You might not need an adapter. This is an owl. I saw one the other day. I chased it. So these pesky little buggers. You see his feet? They look real small, right? They just like chilling like that. No! This dude got some daddy long legs. Look, they like lifted his fupa and just... <laughs> He got some long legs under there. Like, where was you hiding them? It even looked like it got knees. That's crazy. Look at his face. He's like, are you done? Can you put it down now? I am uncomfortable being this exposed. <laughs> you know the flap on a box of fries? You can actually fold it and put your ketchup on it. For real? Is it just McDonald's? Or is everywhere doing this? Because this is actually genius. Keep the fries and the ketchup separated. Or, you know, you could drizzle it on top like a monster. This is how they water the grass in Arizona. And by water, I mean we painting it. Literally dying the grass. Dying the dying grass. <laughs> it's, it's not a very good color. You see the sun, it just dries it out. It was 119 degrees the other day. And it's like, we, we want green grass. It looks very convincing. Like it's either you get fake grass or this. Dads will really do anything to have the greenest lawn on the block. But this, too far. Why do they call candy corn, candy corn? This made of corn syrup and food dye. What does that have to do with corn? So when you stack the candy corn in a circle and keep stacking it up, it looks like a corn on the cob. Wow, if that ain't magical, I don't know, go to Disneyland. So I've been doing this wrong all these years. These air fresheners, you open it like that and then the smell comes through. You told me this was wrong. You're supposed to pop the top off. I didn't even know the top came off. You told me every single mother in every household that bought one of these didn't know this because I've only seen it like this with the scent wax exposed. I, I, I. When you order an $18 drink. Uh, y'all see that? Would you like some drink with your ice cube? Why is it so large? The size of a stick of butter. Starbucks does this too. But they do it in little pieces so you don't notice. Mexican moms be like, so they take the mole jar, soak it in water until they can rip the tag off, and then put it in the cabinet because hmm, this is a very good looking jar and I refuse it to throw out good looking jars. Mole? Nah, this fine china now. When you want brick walls, but you ain't got any bricks. Sir, nobody's gonna know. How would they know? Pulled it off like a dang stencil. It looked like a brick, that's, that's good enough for me. But it was not a brick. They weren't hand laid and cemented and there was no process. The process was skipped over. Same with this, it's not actually bricks. He's drawing the rocks. He making it look like somebody hand made this wall like it was made with love. Nah, we live in a house of lies. So on an eight card, there's actually a hidden eight and they outline in it, there it is. Y'all did that so nicely, my hands would have been like. Okay, but they do this for the eight, but not the other numbers. Explain. 
After all my years drinking these, I finally figured out that you could reverse the top and close it again. There's a lot of things about this that we didn't know. When I was a kid, we would just twist the cap open and just glug, glug, glug. No. Revolutionary. Mind-blowing. But nobody even knows how to use it. And people are just now figuring this out years later. Faking wood grain for theater. They painted this. Is that cardboard? Y'all really make cardboard look like wood? You just slide it on down and it's a fake wood grain. That feels illegal. Y'all are kind of smart. I just found out that the division symbol is just a blank fraction with dots replacing the numerator and the denominator. I looked at that and I was like, yeah, you're right actually. It's just a fraction. Why don't they teach us this in school? You know, if it wasn't already common sense that you are not allowed to park by a fire hydrant, what if there's a fire? They will literally take the hose, break your car windows to get it through to put out the fire. This is why you don't do it. I mean, I feel like they did this to teach them a lesson. They could have easily went around the car, but no, 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 no. We gonna <laughs> no more windows. I found this out in my other video. This is how they x-ray small children and babies. They can't be moving or whatever. And they put them in this little vase to keep them still during the x-ray. <laughs> you know, this is how claustrophobia gotta start. Imagine being stuck in this, like, you can't move. You don't know what to do. Good thing they're still dumb. Apparently, a lot of people don't know about yellow watermelon. And I had one for the very first time a few days ago. I ordered a fruit cup. And I, I thought it was a pineapple. And I ate it. I was like, oh, what is this magnificent fruit? It's like an apple. No. It was just so crispy and delicious. And unlike anything I've ever had before. So it does taste different. 10 out of 10 would recommend. The yellow ones are just as delicious as the red ones. And they also taste very different. But very delicious would recommend. Oh, so this is how cashews grow? I mean, I knew they grew on trees, but I, I wasn't expecting this. They look like mushrooms with faces. Look, you can't tell me that is not a nose. That is a nose. There is a little man growing a hat on a tree. And that's how you get a very fancy nut. I gotta see more pictures of this. Oh, this is legit. Yes, ma'am. Why do they look so funny? They look like mushrooms. This is real. Apparently, these Frappuccino bottles that you buy at like the gas station, Walmart, whatever, they come in a bottle like this because you're supposed to freeze them and then it turns into like a slushy, a Frappuccino, if you will. Why don't they sell them in the freezer then? I was today years old when I realized that aubergines are also called eggplant. And you know why they call them an eggplant? Because when they're babies and still growing, they actually look like eggs. They're white. And then they turn purple? I did not know this. Ain't nobody ever questioned why an eggplant called an eggplant. Uh, that don't make no sense until now. Excellent. Did you know Spongebob's mom and dad are not potatoes or chocolate chip cookies? Look at her! You can't tell me that's not a chocolate chip cookie. Maybe an oatmeal one. They're actually old dried up sponges. Which actually makes perfect sense. Cause they're old! Fun facts! Your birthday is also technically your mom's birthday. It's my birthday, but your mom birthed you on that day. Since caffeine is a drug, the cashiers at Starbucks are technically drug dealers. Uh-oh. Nutty nutty. Your right elbow has never been touched by your right hand. Uh, uh, that's true. I don't think that is possible and can ever be possible and that is gonna bother me. Y'all just ruined my night with this. How about them pizza boxes? Not just a box. Also, a stand. Like, you can fold it and it's wham, bam, a pizza stand. Ma'am. Kind of useless, but I mean, if you want to put the pizza on the pedestal, it's very own throne. You know these big lighters? When you cut it in half, it is a regular lighter just chilling inside. He's just wearing baggy clothes. I guess all this just serves for protection. Armor, if you will. You know, for babies who are too scared to get their thumbnail too close to the fire. And by baby, I mean me. Are you ready to see what the inside of a turtle looks like? Why? I don't know what you were expecting, but it's not this. So the shell isn't an accessory. It does not not sit on top like a hat. It's literally part of them. And their spine, look how it just like goes on the top of the shell and into its back legs. Like, it is built funny. They gotta lug around all of that. Its back is on the top and then like its abdomen is like on the bottom. Kind of built like a scooter. No wonder they so slow. Y'all know the Vans logo, right? Vans off the wall. So it's actually the square root of answer. So it's not actually Vans, it's a square root. What do math and skateboards have in common? Uh, this allegedly. Now I can't unsee it. But anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. Go.
make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click, and comment below. Let me know which one of these like blew your mind. And make sure you subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.